along the Alifaya River are pre preparing for potential flooding. Good evening and thank you so much for joining us everyone. I'm Serena Fazan. ABC Action News reporter Heather Lee shows us how the water is already causing problems at local parks. It's hard to even tell this is Lithia Springs. It's normally open for swimming, coming up to about your waist or above your head at the deepest point, but not today. Right now, if you stand on the boil, it's probably going to be about 12, 15 feet above the top of your head. Paul Miller, a ranger at Lithia Springs Park, says if it continues rising, roads will be washed out and folks living nearby won't be able to drive to their houses. Pretty soon you'll see them start parking their cars out on Lithia Pinecrest Road, and that's when you know that the houses over there are starting to be affected. On top of that, the water is murky and dirty, making it hard to see what's underneath. Snakes and spiders, things you don't normally see, are searching for higher ground and may be a danger to you. It's why he's telling these folks looking to bike the preserve trail they may want to find another park. He also suggests staying off the river when it's like this. When you get this amount of rainfall, you know, I think the river normally runs maybe at two knot current, real slow, real lazy. But right now I've seen it at this height and at this speed wrap canoes around trees. It's it's it, it's impressive. In Lithia, Heather Lee, ABC Action News.